Hello, this is uh, Derek from uh, Mark Wahlberg Airstream and RV. Uh, as promised, I said a uh, quick little walk around video of this Atlas uh, from Airstream, uh, Tommy Bahama edition that uh, we have here on consignment sale. Um, so hopefully this gives you a little bit better idea of what we were talking about. Um, just doing a lap around the outside, I'd say she's exceptionally clean. Um, I guess worth pointing out, she has not been cleaned up since she came in on uh, Friday when they dropped it off. Um, so she's still kind of got a few little bugs. Um, the hood looks relatively free of any major rock chips. Definitely no dents or anything like that. It looked like there's just a smash bug. Yeah, besides a few bugs squished on the front end. Uh, looks like it's free of any, any wear and tear. Which doesn't surprise me. I will say the paint on these is exceptionally good. It's very thick. Airstream goes through a lot of trouble on the paint job of these things. So they definitely seem to hold up. Um, the rest of the exterior is definitely clean. Unmolested state. Tommy Bahamas get the great badge on him. Kind of a great fit and finish to that. Back end is clean. Got the parking sensors back there. Backup camera up top there. Love the big Mercedes badge on those. That's a unique touch. I think Airstream's about the only one that runs that giant. Emblem back there, good good look to it. Love the awning, nice power awnings on these. These do have a seismic sensor, so if the wind knocks those around, it will go ahead and put itself away, to kind of protect itself. Got some lockable outside storage. This does have a removable shelf in there. Once you remove that out, you have ability to kind of put some golf bags in there. Vent for the furnace. Tires and wheels, I will say I like the Alcoa wheels. Those are very easy to clean, maintain. Don't have to polish them regularly. Power step leads us into the main cabin. Switch over to wide angle. Nice mirror in place there. Basically you run this coach main control panel here and then I have a few breakout panels the majority of it can be taken care of right there great cockpit on these it's definitely one of the nicer changes year over years these are way more Mercedes up front rather than Amazon delivery van from the driver seating memory to the heated seats the advanced cruise control so adaptive cruise, which is nice. And all the infotainment's all Mercedes now. You go at the back of the camera. Secondary stereo, that's for the back half of the house here. One of the first breakout panels basically lets me just get to that quicker than going all the way over there. Got the TV, this is power up or down out of the pedestal there. Uh, the bar set here is unique to the Tommy Bahama. say Airstream definitely does a better job of finishing these units out all the way just carpet throughout nothing's left looks like it was untouched um, I noticed the stovetop looked like it's never been turned on the nice residential faucets and sinks definitely stand out as a difference with Airstream 2 there's another one of those pop-out panels Refrigerator, freezer, it's a good size on both of those, and then the microwave above, convection microwave oven. Uh, suburban hot water on demand system, another pop-out panel, let me run that coach room back here, 
the best shower in the game. You know, nice residential size shower. Love the bathrooms in these. Porcelain toilet. Um, full door. Has a little lock. Undo the lock. We have a full bathroom. Does have its own ventilation. Does have good ventilation. Fully ducted air conditioning. Uh, the LED lights in here have a great light and tone to them. A lot of cheap LEDs and other coaches kind of have a terrible hospital color to them. These have a nice warm color that was picked up by Airstream. Our shade can be provided here. The sunroof can be fully open for ventilation as well too. Um, as far as wear and tear on the inside, uh, crawling around in here, the one spot that I found that does looks like it just got some wear to it. I don't know, is right here. Get up and personal. Hasn't torn through, but definitely has a little fraying here. I know this sounds a little. That was like the only spot I could find on the floor that probably. After some cleanup, it'll be much harder to see, but there'll always be maybe just a little bit of a spot there. Um, the rest of the flooring seems to be without any blemish. Um, hope this is detailed enough that you got a kind of good idea what's going on with this thing. It's in great condition. Uh, this is what you're looking for. This would be a great example to own. Um, let me know if you get any other questions. Uh, once again, Derek Hadesee from Mark Wahlberg Airstream and RV. Thanks and have a great day.